Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Hope everybody is healthy and happy. Uh, it's a gorgeous day here today. Uh, let's go ahead and check in with HQ in the year 2020 to see how things are on his end. HQ, do you copy? Yeah, I copy. Uh, hey, you know you can just call me Sean instead of HQ. Yeah, but my name's Sean. Wouldn't that get a bit confusing? Okay, just call me Sean one then. Uh, hold on a minute. If anyone's going to be called Sean number one, it's going to be me. Uh, hold on a minute means to stop right there. Why would you be Sean one? I came first since I'm in the year 2020. Yeah, but you're old news. <laughs> he means that I'm not new or exciting anymore. Hmm. Truth be told, we don't really need to refer to each other by our names. We're the only two people talking, so... You're going to know I'm referring to you. Uh, truth be told means to be perfectly honest. I suppose you're right. Hey, that was an awesome live stream you did the other day. A lot of people didn't spot those Easter eggs that I left in that Walkie Talkie Wednesday video. Uh, an Easter egg is a message, image, or a hidden feature, uh, either in a video game, a film, or other electronic medium. Yeah, it was great. Uh, some people were saying that they were uh, taken by surprise. When someone says that they're taken by surprise, it means that uh, it was uh, they weren't prepared uh, or it was an unexpected thing that happened. Yeah, to all the viewers who are currently watching, I'll be leaving Easter eggs in my videos, not all my videos. It's sort of a reward for the subscribers who watch faithfully and intently uh, to give them some bonus points during the Kahoot game on our live streams on Monday. Yeah, we'll also be leaving Easter eggs on our social media accounts, so make sure you check those prior to the Monday live stream. I'll leave uh, the links uh, to the social medias in the descriptions of every video, including this one. And don't forget, the Kahoot pin will be posted on all my social medias 30 minutes prior to the live stream beginning. And on that note, I had a thought last night. Have you ever wondered what those aliens look like, the ones that took over the future? in the year 2120. And on that note is a phrase uh, used to uh, change the topic or end the conversation. Uh, in this case, uh, he's using it to uh, change the topic. Honestly, no, I haven't given it any thought, uh, but I'm sure we'll eventually find out what the future looks like. Given the opportunity, would you travel to the future to see what it's like? <laughs> sure, I go to the future when pigs fly. Uh, when pigs fly means never. Um, things are pretty bad here in the year 2020, but I think it's worse in the year 2120. Uh, besides, our great-grandson doesn't seem to be the sharpest crayon in the box. That's a derogatory term um, to refer to someone who is not very smart. Uh, who knows, maybe pigs fly in the future. <laughs> uh, yeah, he seems like he was on the warpath. Um, to be on the warpath uh, means that you were very angry. Uh, should we be talking about this? Can't he hear us all the time? He's not Santa Claus. I think it'd be cool to see what the future holds. We already know what the future holds. Global domination by aliens. Yeah, you're probably right. You'd have to be off your rocker to want to go to the future. <laughs> that means you'd have to be crazy. <laughs> Those two need to be dealt with. <gasps> no! Hey guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you hit that bell for notifications and go ahead and smash my face to subscribe to the channel. But not this face, that face. Thanks again, guys. Make sure you show some love down in the comment section. Peace.